this one's very different in tone to the one I read earlier. It's more the tone of anger that seems to be coming out in the second half. This was written in the aftermath of the vigil for Sarah Everard. Even small flames can be fierce. Lighting a candle felt feeble in a week when wind wolf whistled through the eaves, stalked around drain pipes, butted against windows and left a familiar fear. A woman's remains were found, a serving police officer arrested. The flame gutters, leaves a shadow at its base, unsure of its foundations. Police warned a vigil would be against the law, court found otherwise. Duchess of Cambridge left a bouquet. As the other woman followed, the sun's glow dimmed. The later image all over the media, the flare of Patsy Stevenson restrained. The Met responded that enforcement was needed because of women's actions, the look what you made me do excuse. It brings to mind Wilde's quote, each man kills the thing he loves, the thing he loves. On Clapham Commons bandstand, flowers, yellow from the Duchess's daffodils, orange dahlias from women offering condolences, red roses from Sarah 